Hey, welcome. Uh, uh, since I've got a, a bit of the uh, cold, <coughs> I'll try to make it uh, simple. Um, so uh, here I just created uh, Susan, you know, uh, mesh monkey, uh, and press W to make it uh, shade smooth. Nothing uh, very incredible. Uh, now I want to make a curve, Bezier curve. Here is um, this curve can be extended. So uh, I'll go into edit mode. Um, you can see I can select and move every. Uh, every part, every handle, it's pretty easy. If I want to met, make a new vertex, I just click Ctrl and left click somewhere else. See? Can uh, make it go uh, wherever I want. Okay. Now I want so our friend Susan here to follow this curve. It's pretty easy. Actually, uh, I just have to select her, go to uh, Object and Strains here, select the curve. So we can click here or click here and on the curve. Same thing. Uh, path. Uh, don't forget to check this. Can be useful. <laughs> uh, then you, s uh, you choose where is the the front direction and the up direction. Uh, set or influence uh, if you want less influence. Um, then place her where you want her to to start. Uh, original position. Then I apply it so it's the, the re really the, the basic place. Oops, I did a mistake. I wasn't on first frame. So now I have to fix this. Up. Now, as you can see, she's following the curve, but uh, not in the, the range, time range I want. So uh, to fix this, I will select the curve. So right click for me, left click if you, if you selected the left click in uh, Blender 2.8. There is this kind of weird thing. I'm right clicking. Uh, I'm an, an old fault. <coughs> yeah. Um, <coughs> anyway, uh, just select object data. Uh, then scroll down to path animation. It, it may be uh, closed, so click to open it. Uh, don't uncheck it. <laughs> uh, very important. Uh, you, uh, you can see on uh, how many frames it, it's, uh, uh, it's cal calculated. Uh, so we'll select uh, 60 since I'm making a 60 frames uh, animation. And now... Okay. Follows the path for, the path for 60 uh, frames. But I don't I want it to be uh, linear like this. Uh, constant, uh, constant speed is... Uh, no. Uh, it's just not what I want. I want it to uh, accelerate, so um, I will say here it's on si calculated on sixty. Uh, no, 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 no.
Now, look. Accelerates in the end. So, uh, basic idea is that from beginning to this, you select 60 and place a keyframe. And in the end, you will choose a less calculation 10 frames. So I have uh, an acceleration uh, in the end since it's shorter. Nothing much more to say. Uh, just tweak it. If it doesn't work, select it. You you just uh, click on constraint and an path. So it re it recalculate recompute it, and you don't uh, you shouldn't have any any kind of trouble. It's pretty easy. I uh, hope it helped some people. Uh, remember you can uh, hit thumbs up uh, etc. And uh, if you have any questions of course feel free to ask in the comments down below. Uh, see you soon.